Now, as the pandemic in the United States reaches new heights, infections among U.S. children grew 40 percent in the last half of July. This comes as schools and parents contemplate the safety of sending children back to school. Health reporter Stephanie Saul is here with an update on the cases. Stephanie? Well, Yuki, there was an explosion of COVID-19 cases among children in the last two weeks of July, according to this new report. It didn't address reasons, but many think it could be related to things like kids at camp, family vacations, and other summer activities. As kids enjoy a summer day at Seeger Playground on Lombard Street, numbers of COVID-19 cases among children are increasing. As of the end of July, more than 338,000 tested positive, according to the Academy of Pediatrics. 97,000 of those cases were reported in just the last two weeks of the month. That's a 40% jump. Coronavirus is mild for most children. Many have no symptoms, but they put others at risk. They can bring virus home to their family. Families, um, many of whom may have um, individuals who are at high risk of, of having an adverse um, experience with an infection. Increasing numbers of children with coronavirus is a concern with some schools opening, like this one in Georgia, where students were seen crowded into a hallway, many not wearing masks. It's now temporarily closed for cleaning after nine students and staff members tested positive. They kind of sent us into school and used us as guinea pigs to see what would happen later on. With the U.S. now passing the 5 million mark of known COVID-19 cases, some health experts say the actual number may be much higher. It is one of the worst public health tragedies in the history of the United States, certainly in the last hundred years. It's a big worry for Mendy McNulty, who's deciding whether her two sons should go back to school. I am nervous about sending them into a building with hundreds of other people when we have been isolated for so many months here in our home. And there is now a growing body of evidence showing children spread the virus as much as adults, if not more. But they don't get ex as sick, except for Hispanic and black children who are impacted more severely by COVID-19. Yuki? Stephanie, thank you.